Welcome to part three, pizza making. We started the program with part one, which was the dough. Part two, which was the sauce, which my wife Elena made. And now we're gonna start part three, which is the pizza. Uh, what I did do here to prepare the dough after it's risen for three or four hours, I added a little bit of flour on both sides. So this way I can play with it and make it nice and round for us. Over here we have the pepperoni, the prepared sauce, red peppers and green peppers for color, and mushrooms, and of course the cheese. So this is your traditional all dressed pizza that you usually buy at a restaurant. So we start by spreading the dough evenly. I'm going to turn it around and just go round and round. Later on, when it's big enough, it's large, I'm going to put it on a pan, 16 inch pan. I already put a little bit of olive oil on it. I'll just spread it a little quicker like this. Make sure that the dough is even everywhere. Just one more time. We're about ready to put it on the pan. So this is the pan that we're going to use. Goes right on top. If you notice, I'm just going to bring the dough up a little bit. So this way when it starts to cook, we're going to have the nice crust all around. a little bit of the beautiful sauce my wife made. Don't go too crazy putting too much because then it's going to be soggy but you just put enough to spread out evenly. There we go. And then we'll start putting the pepperoni. Make sure that it's spread out. Now the next step will be adding the cheese. This is mozzarella. You can buy that uh, at your local grocer. What's wonderful is when you make it at home, you can put as much cheese as you want. Usually that's the most expensive part of the pizza. Then we're gonna add a little bit of mushrooms. So this way they cook on top. The next step will be the green peppers. And just for a little bit of color, we'll put the red peppers. So basically this is it. This is our all dressed pizza. We're going to put it in the oven. We'll be right back and we'll show you what it looks like. 